For me, this is an issue that hits home. The unprecedented flooding in the Missouri River Basin last year clearly demonstrates the need for reauthorization and for reforms to ensure that levies are properly certified. In working on this bill in committee, Senator Vitter and I worked together to include language to require the Army Corps and FEMA to work together to develop common standards for levy certification to help local communities address their needs. Past lapses in this program have also created uncertainty for homeowners and created significant burdens for those participating in the flood insurance program, including several in Kalispell, Montana that assist program participants in processing claims. Lapses have also created additional roadblocks for the housing industry, with an average of 1,400 closings canceled each day during the 53 days during which this program lapsed in 2010. At a time when the housing market is still very fragile, this is something that not only can we not afford, but it would be self-inflicted injury. We can prevent this, we know what needs to be done, and we know how to do it. There's no reason for a lot of brinkmanship that goes on in Washington on this bill, and there's especially no reason for it when you have an issue of this kind with such broad bipartisan support. There's a strong bipartisan majority here in the Senate that wants to see long-term reauthorization of this program, and I certainly will do all I can uh, with the help of Senator Vitter to ensure that we get this passed before the program expires at the end of May.